Certainly am, but I'm going for Wonder Woman. Claire in a Wonder yeah. Woman costume. How about that? Okay? <laughs> All right, parents, school is out, and you're probably looking for something to do with the kids that won't cost you a bundle, maybe even nothing. Parenting coach Pam Dyson is here with five things you can do with a basic item you have in your kitchen right now. We're talking, hello, cookie sheet. That's right. Thank you so much for joining us. My pleasure. And all the moms and dads out there with toddlers are, are like, please give me something, something to, do. to do. First of all, kids love magnets. They do. And what family with children does not have a refrigerator full of magnets? Yes. Right? Yes. So get out a cookie sheet. Get them some of those magnets off the refrigerator. Mm -hmm. Maybe you have some ABC magnets. They could practice their ABCs. Maybe they could write their name, make a design, create their own little masterpiece right next there on a cookie sheet. Next time we're going to spell great day here because I can't do anything go. with A, B, C, D. <laughs> can I? How about, how about B, A, C? Oh, yes, I can. B, A, D. There it is. Bad. She's bad. <laughs> she know. There it is. Okay. Thank you. Voila. See, and I'm 48 and that was fun. And it was fun. And you know what? <laughs> Take a picture of that masterpiece and maybe it could be the front of your Christmas card this year. There. Oh, that's very cute. There All right. Go. Why do I have a bag of rice? Uh, what looks like an unsharpened pencil. Well, you're exactly right. That's what it is. Um, here's another fun idea to do with the cookie sheet. Put some uncooked rice okay. right there. Spread it around. Kids love touching it. It's a very tactile mm -hmm. um, experience Feels for good. them. Uh -huh. It does. It's and it is very relaxing. They can use their finger or they could use this pencil, make a design, practice writing their name, whatever they want to do. Okay, finger. Use your finger. That'll finger, probably finger. Work I need a bigger. There you go, you made a heart it shape. It is, it is, it is a heart. And you it's know what this feels heart. like to me? A zen garden. There you go, very, it's very relaxing. Zen. Yes, it's very mm -hmm. relaxing. Very much Can you so. see my heart? There we it is. love you. Good job, Yes, girl. we do. Thank you for watching. Awesome. Great day. We love you. All right, so <laughs> next. All right, I'm going to take off jewelry. Okay. Because you've got some pudding. I do. A spoon uh -huh. and a cookie sheet. And a cookie sheet, yes. Okay, what's happening? Well, you've heard of finger painting. Well, why okay. not finger paint? Mm. <laughs> it's all, you know it'll already be fun, It's right? already going to be fun. So you have your child spread it out. You can use a spoon, use a spatula, and then that's when the fun begins. Okay. Am I, am are I, you ready? Am I going for another masterpiece here? You are. This one will be easy. Okay. Sorry. Got to get rid of that. That's right. That's hard to do. I'm using my fingernail. There you go. Can you see that? Is that? Can you see my smiley face? There it is. That yes. Okay. All yeah. right. How easy is cleanup? You just lick it up. Absolutely. I didn't yeah. have breakfast. Okay. Mix, mix two kinds of pudding and it'll look even better. All right. Now we have marbles right. and what looks like parchment, parchment paper. paper. Okay. If you have cookie sheets in your home, you probably have parchment paper because mm -hmm. you're probably a baker. So what we're going to do is we're going to take some paint, preferably washable paint. Okay. Um, just in case the kids are going to get all over and help me out here. Put some. Am I doing more finger painting? Blobs. No, we're not going to paint with our fingers this time, Carol. Okay. We're gonna any put, color will do. Any color will do. Preferably oh, more than what one. That's what marbles were for. And we're going to put marbles in there, and then you're going to roll it back and oh, forth. Oh, awesome. Okay, let's see. Can I can I do yeah. anything? Can I make anything there happen here? Oh, roll now, this it through is, the colors. This is like a game and it is. performance art right here. And it makes a really, really neat marbleized picture. Okay, we can, this, this is, look at, now that, St. Louis Art Museum, call me. There you right go. Right here. There you go. Perfect. Oh, that's cute. All right, it's now we're going to make some Play-Doh because I right. have banned Play-Doh from my house. Well, store-bought Play-Doh, first of all, it's expensive. And once you've opened a can, it's usually dry and crumbly, and it sticks mm -hmm. in the carpet, and um, it just doesn't shape as well for kids. They get frustrated because it's all clumpy. So this you is made homemade Play-Doh. Recipes at greatdaysaintlos.com, yes, but what is. is in this? It's flour, salt, water, okay. vegetable oil, mm -hmm. cream of tartar, which gives it a lot of nice uh, softness and mm -hmm. keeps it soft for a long period of time, and then whatever color food coloring you want to put in. And so you, you can probably make it have everything. You Maybe you all don't have cream of tartar, but you have the rest of that But you probably sure. do, and you okay. just cook it, and it forms a ball, and you dump it out, and you knead it, and you get it nice and soft and squishy. You know, forget the kids. This grown-ups, come on, girls' night, That's we need some right. therapy, don't we? Punch it out on the uh, cookie sheet. Got is this a cookie bat? Cutters. What is that? I think it's a butterfly. Is it a oh. But if you want it to be <laughs> a bat, bat, it could be a bat. Okay. All right. And while I'm popping these out, mm -hmm. an easy gift idea. Yes. If you have a child in your family that has a summer birthday mm -hmm. and you don't want to spend a lot of money, head to the dollar store, buy a shiny new cookie sheet for a dollar. How about some craft sticks? 
some magnetic letters. You can do so much with craft you sticks. You can. Um, washable markers. I even found some Play-Doh and cookie cutters and a little set together. And a drawing pad. Put it all together. Nice Buy ribbon a, on it. Yes. And you're finished. Exactly. All right, Pam. Aw. My heart to your Thank heart. Thank you. Thank you very I much. It. Thank you, Pam, as My always. Pleasure. Well, coming up, she's known as the queen of daytime talk, but now we're learning that former Governor Rob McGoy.